We've made it easier to create and manage work areas. When we run machine sim on this part, notice the part is tilted towards the back of the machine. Our preference is to have it tilt towards the front of the machine. We'll go to Operation Manager and we'll change to a work area limit, except there are none in this case. This normally would mean a change to the MDD, but now we can go to the Document Control dialog, select Work Areas, and now we can add a work area. We'll give it the appropriate parameters. Notice you can also choose a default work area for the entire part file. We'll go back to Operation Manager and now notice this work area is available. But instead of changing it here, let's try another approach. Let's go to Operation Data and we can also change it here. We'll now run Machine Simulation again. But the part is still tilted towards the back of the machine. This means we've input the parameters incorrectly. This would normally again mean another MDD change, but instead we'll open the DCD, go back to Work Areas, and edit the parameters on this work area. Notice the Update Ops button. This will update all operations using this work area. Now when we run Machine Sim again, the part is oriented correctly towards the front of the machine like we desired. Also available, by right-clicking on a work area, you can select ops using work area, you can apply work area to selected ops, or you can delete the work area. If you choose to delete the work area, you will get a warning message telling you which operations the work area is used and what will happen depending on your choice.